This is really a game changer, I think. Uh, programming these little devices to make what you want with low power, nothing special, nothing additional. It's, and it's just working, it's so great. So you have all the information on the ground from a lot of sensors spread around your field and you have the information in the air. And you can really perfectly know at every moment in time what's happening inside the plant and this is going to be a huge difference in knowledge. the spectroscopy aspect with the spectrometers and the UV cameras for the, the SO2 flux. The idea is to tie that into the direct sampling methods that we also took. The whole spectroscopy side was the easiest part. If you want to fly into the plume, then there's an awful lot of turbulence. You're going to be flying it until you can barely see it. So having the LEDs on the spectrometer means that, well, you can see that you've plugged it in and you can see that it's acquiring spectra, so you know immediately that the flight controller is running the code that you've written for it and, and everything's working well. For such a simple feature, it's remarkably useful and, and saves you, you know, potentially a disaster because most of these field expeditions, you really only get one shot.